Hello everyone, my name is Delta Sword Sky. Welcome to the podcast Sky Time. I'm here with Serious Time as always. We're doing E3 again because views. Well, it's because E3 just ended today. Today was the last day. And uh, we're going to go through all the stuff. We talked about the leaks from before, so I'm curious to see what of the leaks were actually correct. I'm going to grab my Switch because eShop sales. Okay. See what went on sale for E3. Why not? Okay. Pause it. Oh, okay. The Switch has been attained. We're good. <laughs> Insert one Romo dog here. So do you want to start with that, or do you want me oh. to just get to the list? Uh, just get to the list. Let's get to the list. I'm going to be slowly putting an eShop card throughout all of this, so... Okay, so, Nintendo. Uh, we're going to watch a trailer right off the bat. No one cares about this press conference. And by that, I mean too many people care, because in you my wanna... opinion, it wasn't great. Do you, uh, have already, you seen the trailer? I've seen all the trailers. Okay, I saw it too. So, Breath of the Wild 2, what did you think of that? I think it's incredibly unnecessary. I don't think we needed a direct sequel to Breath of the Wild 2. That's fair. And it is my favorite game of all... Sorry, a direct sequel to Breath of the Wild. And it's my favorite game of all time. But I really like the creepy vibe that they're going for, because last time they did that, Majora's Mask happened, and that game was cool. Some people are saying... Zelda's haircut sucks. That that dead uh, that, that dead dude at the beginning is Ganon. I don't know, man. I just work here. Uh, what do you think, Luigi's Mansion Three? I'm always down for those. I I've never played the first Luigi's Mansion. It's the only one I've played. But I 100%ed Dark Moon. So oh yeah. I, I really enjoyed it. I think they're really fun games, and I'm always up for more. Uh. Uh, yeah, the Sword and Shield and Link's Awakening release dates. Okay, no, no, you're missing Animal Crossing. Oh, sorry, is, I actually genuinely did miss that. It's a series I've always wanted to get into, so I'm happy they're bringing it to the Switch. I love slavery. Yep, it's great. Uh, Mario Maker 2, I'm hyped for. But wait, 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 sorry. So, Link's Awakening, that's a remake? Yes, kind of. I'm not a fan of any of their remakes. It's I really like the art style. No, the art style is what's good about them. But, like, I've heard nothing but horror stories. <laughs> like, yeah, I, I don't uh, know. Not about Link's Awakening, per se, but just the previous ones. I don't know, I'm, I'm, I've am I'm still got a lot of hype for it. Just the art style itself is selling it for me currently. Um, Mario Maker 2, personally don't really care i was never a big mario maker guy i would play that i would it's, play the hell out of that it's a blast Switch. don't get me wrong i've played it with uh Bodie the great but like i don't know it's not my favorite game what's astral chain don't know didn't see that do Lazy. you do you want to look it up or not not really you just look up a quick like oh uh, hold up this has like pictures you know what no we'll go through this one after all right Sorry, just a different website for okay. those listening. So for the reference of the next one, Marvel Ultimate Alliance, I think I can confidently say, is probably both in your top ten and my top ten. Despite everyone saying it's a, like a mediocre game, it was, we have a lot of nostalgia towards it. It's a it. good game, like, undoubtedly. The second one was just okay, but, like, put simply, I love that game. So a third one really does not scream to me currently they haven't done anything that makes me go wow that's cool it's just i'm just happy there's gonna be another one yeah i mean it's just, there's an mua3 i do like the black order though i'm a big fan of the black order so i, I think don't know what cool. they are the children of thanos oh yeah Proxima midnight corvus glaive i don't care about them it's, it's black dwarf not call obsidian though you know for me i think marvel ultimate alliance is one of those games it's not like breath of the wild 2 yeah. for example it's more like it doesn't matter what they do in the game people are you play it for the game yeah not for what the game's about okay cadence of hyrule it's what is that i'm not a fan of crypt of the necro dancer i don't think it's a bad game by any means i personally didn't enjoy it i also don't know what crypt of the necro dancer is basically there's a beat and you have to oh is it a dance game yeah, you no, you move to the beat and attack enemies it's a dungeon crawler where you move to the beat so they That's just threw a, bad they threw a zelda skin over it it's cool don't get me wrong it just it's not my style of game i know uh if you remember munatsu garrett yep played the flip out of uh crypt of the necro dancer so is it a side scroller no 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 it okay isn't. it's uh it's top down uh, three houses. Fire Emblem. 
bane of my I've debated buying Fire Emblem Warriors because it's on the E3 sale. Dude, I've like I never like, played a single one. I've All I always know is, wanted to. That's my why. friends played it, and it seems cool. It's my boy Crom. My I boy just Crom sells it for me. It's not my style. Dragon Quest. I Dragon Quest is not my kind of thing. Yeah, no. I don't even know what No More Heroes is. Uh, not totally <gasps> sure. Another Mario and Sonic okay, at the Olympics. Okay. Real talk. Ah, uh, it's gonna be good. I'm gonna. You well, know what? Okay, okay. Cyber Cyberpunk 2070. What? 2020 Olympic Games, guys. Okay, no. Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. Keanu Reeves, more like Keanu Reeves. Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. Hear me out. I, everyone I know owns a Switch currently, like that I hang out with. So I will actually have people to play it with, and I have nostalgia towards the one on the DS. One of one of the ones. So I'm okay with it. Do we even have to mention Are Resident five? Evil Five and Six? Like mm, they exist. No, not really. That's, and that's okay. all. So no, so that's all for Nintendo. Okay, okay. We're gonna move on to my. Unless you have any stuff to say about. Um. For website one here, yeah, the recap. I mean, Banjo Kazooie and the hero. Did they not mention that here? No, those are really big. Oh no, I think it's because there was that the Nintendo this is Direct games list. Yeah, that was the Direct is below. Okay. They talk about other stuff after, okay, but this is the games that. list yeah. we're going okay. through. Microsoft. Let's see what of our predictions. Halo Five Infinite. Yep, Project Scarlet right there. So the leak wasn't entirely wrong. Gears Five. That was also there. It's just like, like. I heard the Gears Five trailer had Billie Eilish in it, and that scares me. Not a lot of things scare me. So I you know don't fear. Seems... I don't fear any man, but that thing, it scares me. You know, Blair Witch VR. I but don't that's, care. That's a cool idea. It's just that I don't like the Blair Witch project. Same. You know, I'd almost get Lego Star Wars, just Lego Star Wars: The Skywalker Saga, because it's episode I, I like one Le to nine. I like Lego Star Wars, but I, I already like... have the I already have the complete edition of. Well, one, two, three, four, five, and six, and those are the only movies. I'd buy it anyways. I like so, Lego Star Wars. I don't know what Bleeding Edge is. Don't remember. Battletoads, though, good. Probably gonna end up picking it up, hopefully. So that's another thing from yeah. the leaks that they talked that's about. Cool. Wasteland 3, Age of Empires 2, don't care. Don't care, don't care. Flight uh, Simulator. Minecraft Dungeons? Okay. What's that? First of all, you skipped over Flight Simulator. That's because I don't care. You know, that's because other people care. That's the thing, though. I don't care though. All right, Minecraft Dungeons. So everyone What's thought this? everyone thought it was Minecraft Two, but it's not. It's a dungeon scroller Minecraft spinoff game. That sounds that sounds meh Decent. on the surface, but it looks fun because you, you play say it's... meh on the surface. But aren't dungeons underground? Exactly. <laughs> you got to get to the dungeon. The rest of the details. It it's four player co op with a bunch of different items and I think classes, and it looks fun. I'm probably going to end up picking it up. Oh, sorry. So just looking at this list, there is one thing that our predictions, that the leak was not correct about. Hmm. Fable. Fable? Yeah. The new Fable. I played the first one. Or no, yeah. I, I played Fable 2 or whatever as a kid. It wasn't bad, but I don't know. I also don't... Oh, sorry. Um, Forza Horizon 4 Lego Speed Champion Edition? <laughs> Is that I, a Lego racing game? I, I don't know. I don't know anything about the Forza franchise. We're not big. Zach, Xbox help me out, games. low key. Hi, Zach. Oh, yeah. Hi, Zach. How are you? Good? Good. Gears Pop? No, I needed that coin. That's lost that's forever. That's my whole my net man. worth. That, that's, uh, that just fell between the slats of my bed. I was scratching the codes with that. Um, This is what we call checkmate. Okay, uh, what's next? Um, Spiritfarer? Coming to Xbox Game Pass? Don't know what that is? Don't know what that is. 12, as you can see, we're really up to date with MicroHard. We, we didn't... I don't know if you watched E3, I didn't. I just watched the recaps. Basically, how it went was, because I'm in high school, everyone at the high school was like, Oh my god, E3! And then instead of doing classes, watched E3, and then just kind of nerded out to me afterwards 12 minutes don't know what that is crossfire x and gears pop i think gears pop is probably something to do with pop finals it's kind of funny i don't know okay take two slash 2k, 2K. games Borderlands three they're still very excited 
Eh, and the Outer Worlds? Don't know. I heard there was a new trailer where they showed gameplay of Fallen Order. People are saying, it's like Dark Souls. Uh, it's Star Wars Dark Souls. Yeah, but isn't the most Dark Souls-esque game out there Crash Bandicoot? Yeah, but... Just like a Dark Souls. Alright, look, Pewds is right. That game's hard. But no, I would... That makes me slightly excited for Fallen Order. Yeah, except for the fact that I don't like don't who's worry. making it. <laughs> Yeah. Legend Season 2. Apex Legend. I don't care. Battle 5. Okay. Battlefield. Really cool series. I would get into it. Uh, Mad in 2020, care. guys. I never expected uh, The it. Sims 4 Island Living. Thank you. Dude, That's what no, was do next you remember, on the list. Do you remember Sims, Sims 2, 2 Castaways? Yes. You still? Uh, we still have the PS2 game. I hope that it's like that. Because if it is, I would genuinely buy Sims 4. Apparently, according to what I heard... They talked about Sims way too damn much. They have, like... The Sims 4 has more DLC than, like, everything I know. Cyberpunk 2070 Keanu Reeves. It's breathtaking! You're breathtaking! Did you know that, uh... That guy got them to donate money to charity. No, they also gave that guy a free copy. No, they were going to, and then he turned it down. Oh. And made them... Oh, really? Yeah, give it money. Give money anyways. That's hilarious. No, Which, like... Witcher 3 Wild Hunt, the complete so, edition. Witcher 3, I believe, is coming to Switch. Yep, I heard. So, like... You know, to quote... I'm kind of impressed, because I know they were doing, with uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey, at least, they're having, um... You have to be connected to the internet to play it, which sucks, because it's a single-player game, but you have to stream it. It's a good way, I just don't like it. I watched, uh... Some Ordinary Gamers, uh, Mudahar, the, the Indian-Canadian dude, if you... Yep. You kept him Philcom. <laughs> mm -hmm. I was wa he I was watching his video about E3 and he was like, dude, if you can get The Witcher 3 running on basically a tablet, <laughs> that's some crazy shit, dude. Yeah. And then Konami's got Contra Anniversary Collection. Actually very excited for Same. both the Contra games. And it's Contra just... Rogue Corps. It's cool. Corps like... or Core? How do you even pronounce that? Is it just Core? I think... I don't know. All I know, I like I like Contra. Yeah, honestly, I would really personally like, uh, I think, Bill Contra. Especially with, sorry, Bill from Contra. With Simon Belmont and Smash, I think Bill is, like, totally an option. I think Bill I feel would be that. kind of cool. Alright, so Deathloop. Don't know. From Bethesda. Scares sorry, me. we're on Bethesda now. I want to look at Deathloop real quick. Uh, Bethesda, Bethesda's in a bit of a rocky spot. Bethes I heard they're putting the game in Fallout 76 finally. Oh, you mean the Battle Royale mode? No, I thought they were, like, finally adding NPCs. Um, okay, so there's Doom Eternal. Okay, the only thing good about Doom Eternal is that Doot Eternal exists. The You can look it up. I think you can just search Doot Eternal. I'll add it in the, uh... I'll, I'm gonna get my phone here so you can see it. And then, yeah, Fallout 76, Nuclear Winter. Um, Elder Scrolls Blades? Yep. There's a lot of uh, some Wolfenstein Commander Keen for the phone. Oh Coma boy! What? Commander oh. Keen, dog. What's next? Uh, Square Enix. Oh boy! Final Fantasy VII remake. <laughs> Okay, everyone's been waiting years for that, and even I have been saying, like, yeah, I'd um, probably get okay, into so it. Okay, so there's a lot of Final Fantasy. Um, well, that's kind of their series. Crystal Chronicles for PS4, Switch, and mobile. Stop putting things on mobile. Really stop. In fact, can we just get rid of phones altogether? No. Yeah. No. I mean, well, all right, look, there's only one good mobile game, and that's Paladin Strike. Battle <laughs> <laughs> Future Fight. Um, eight Final Fantasy eight remastered Final Fantasy fourteen Shadowbringers. My phone wasn't charging. I'm upset. Circuit Superstars. That sounds like a racing game. Probably is. There's okay. There's a lot of games that I just don't care about or don't know. War of the Visions. Oh, Final Fantasy Brave. Exvius. Romancing Saga three. Sounds like a good love sim. Scarlet Grace, but not for the Xbox Scarlet. Dragon Quest. Builders 2. Where is... I thought A-Day was Square Enix. I uh, thought what? A-Day. Avengers A-Day. Oh. I don't know. Just keep going. Well, hopefully it pops up. If it, if it doesn't, 
The Last Remnant Remastered and don't Trials know. of Mana. Don't know, don't know, don't know. Okay, Ubisoft. Ubisoft. Ghost Recon Breakpoint. Yeah, because we totally The Division need more. 2, For Honor, shut up. Watchdags Legion. Assassin's Creed Odysseus. 9,000. Roller Champions and Gods and Monsters. I, I, at this point, if Ubisoft shut down tomorrow, I don't think I would even care. Yeah, but like, Rabbids. When's the last time you saw Rabbids game? Mario and Rabbids? When was that? Like, last year, two years ago. Exactly. I'm just gonna say, they've been here. I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be DLC for that game coming out. Nick's Assassin's Creed is known for bunnies. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> well, like, here's my problem. is like, Assassin's Creed is just kind of like... It's at that point where it's just, oh my god, stop making it. People will buy it because it has its diehard fans, but like, oh my god, stop it. Like, the whole taking it to Egypt, putting it on a pirate ship, and then making the game actually good, okay, unlike well, the, the other one on the a pirate Egypt, ship. The Egypt one switched it's, it up. It's cool. Those are cool <laughs> ideas. But like, hey guys, it's, it's Ezio for the fourth game. And he stabbed the dude just like he did in the first game with Ezio. Except in this one, you can't use a broom as a sword. Still my favorite part of Assassin's Creed 2. Sega. Panzer Dragoon. You can read the Sega one because I'm tired of reading all of this stuff. Fantasy Star Online. Don't care. Sega Genesis Mini Console. What's the, what is it with the mini consoles? I'm sick of mini consoles. Same. With mini games like Mega Man, The Wily Wars, Earthworm Jim. Yo! Dude. The Sonic... Oh, shoot. Elon Musk is going to be happy. Sonic the Hedgehog 1 and 2. And Echo the Dolphin. Echo the Dolphin and 35 more classic games. Namco Bandai. You remember when they were Bandai Namco? Because I'm pretty sure that's what it is. It's Bandai Namco. Maybe these people just messed it up. Tech yeah. Radar, what are you doing? All right. Tears of Arise. Don't know what that is. Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. It has Dragon Ball in it. I'll buy it. Code Vein don't know what it is rad the dark pictures anthology man of medan now that's edgy that that is a little edgy all right various elden ring dying light 2 wait elden ring another from software game it's dark souls oh yeah no right that's that's what somebody told me is it was just george rr R. martin does dark souls doesn't sound half bad yeah no, it sounds dying okay. light 2 that's a thing. Way to the woods. Don't even... Sorry, that's Team 17. Dauntless. Uh, still know nothing on it. Uh, I'm sorry. They're bringing Dead by Daylight to the Switch. Are you going to play it? I mean, I I got it for free on PS4. That's why I play oh. it. Oh, yeah. Ukulele and the Impossible Lair by Platonic. And then... Sa Sakuna of Rice and Ruin. Sounds Asian. I like it. <laughs> Okay, now weeb. we're moving on to the Nintendo Direct. Let's go. Uh, Tristan, you can continue if you want. Yes, okay. Uh, that's way too much. Uh, okay, Breath of the Wild 2, Luigi's Mansion, Link's Awakening, Animal Crossing. Yeah, okay. Um, Banjo, oh yeah, here we go. The hero from uh, Super Smash Brothers. I know you don't play fighting games, so that means nothing to you. For me, right. it's just Fire Emblem Pokemon Trainer, I think. Because it's like four heroes in one, so I'm pretty sure it's just going to be Pokemon Trainer, but it's a Fire Emblem thing. Cause what are you talking about? The like new what game? The hero. Super Smash Bros. new character. He's the hero from Dragon Quest. Banjo's not from Dragon Quest? I know. They released two characters. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I was like, what? So, the hero, to, from what I see, is just every Fire Emblem character with the swords, except you can swap between them like pokemon trainer is how i think they're gonna work but no one gives a shit banjo kazooie okay that even i'm hyped for that and i don't even play the game i've been waiting for this since smash 4 the top of my list was shrek goku then banjo kazooie <laughs> shrek <laughs> tristan I, I did genuinely when they released the poll i was part of the meme and i voted shrek I think the game I listed was on the GameCube. He was in, like, DreamWorks Kart Racing. Stop. <laughs> oh, my God. 
Uh, I'm sure Daddy Sakurai is never gonna release another <laughs> one of those because <laughs> it was probably like, yo, we should we should put out this poll and let them vote on what characters they want in the game, and then everyone voted Shrek and Goku. <laughs> yeah, no, but Banjo Kazooie, I I'm happy. It's good. I like this. This is great. Yeah, dude, Banjo, I'm hyped for. All right, I'll do. Oh no, hold up. Let's see what the next. Uh, okay. So. No. Just Basically, for EA, I'll do this. Alright. Um, the, the biggest thing was Fallen Order. No Titanfall, as well, which was, I think... No, wait, never mind. That's not Microsoft, is it? No, that's... But... Okay, so yeah, but mostly... <laughs> Apex Legends! Fallen Order, same guys. People, and, and I quote Tech Raider here, it's looking a bit like Uncharted with a lightsaber and force powers. And then, I don't care about Apex, Apex Legends. Apex Legends! Like, I think that game looks bad. Apex Legends! If I'm you a... don't play Apex Legends, you're basically a loser, even though the game is dead. Please, I, I let play, it die. I play Realm Royale, which is infinitely better. It's I'm the sorry, best. Do you not remember the battle pass in Dota? Oh, right, you didn't play, and I didn't play at that time. But there was a battle pass in Dota where there was a battle royale. So that's the best battle royale. No. Actually, the best battle royale is probably... Um, I, I can't say that without getting demonetized. So we're going to go with Minecraft Hunger Games. Okay, that's fair. Okay, so everyone wanted to hear about Dragon Age 4, but lol, too bad. Yeah, I... And then <sighs> nothing from PopCap. Okay, my boys made, like, one game. They made, like, PVZ, and there, there Plants seems... Plants vs. Zombies, for those who don't know what that is. I'm sorry... For those who don't know what that is... Dude, when your friends mentioned that, I was really confused. Because, like, I'm not a fucking loser who abbreviates a three-word thing. <laughs> yeah, but, like, it's easier. It's, like, three syllables Dude, do you know like how many games are, are PVZ? How many? A million. Plants vs. Zombies, Plants vs. Zombies 2, Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare... Okay, that's it. You know, you Plans can do, you can do Micro Hard. Microsoft... Alright, uh... Okay, apparently X Xbox Elite Wireless Controller Series 2. Ooh, I just for, hit a fat dab for, for that. For Project Scarlet. I don't care. Also, of course, it's breathtaking. You're breathtaking. Thank you, Keanu. Very cool. Um, so, like, what did... What did he... How is Keanu Reeves related to this? Like, I know he's in Cyberpunk 2077, but, like... Oh, he was just doing the conference. Was it? Yeah. He was doing some of the stuff. But he's starring in Cyberpunk's 2077. Yeah, no, he's also the star. He's in the game. Yeah, that's what I just asked you. you. Know, no, he's like, in the game, but he's, he was also just doing the conference Okay. for the game. That makes sense. So he was wait. He said, it's breathtaking. And then he was waiting for the teleprompter to give him the next thing to say. So it was taking a little bit. So someone just shouted at him, you're breathtaking. And then the meme happened. Low key, my mustache is bothering the living hell out of me right now. Oof. So, you know. So, yeah, Cyberpunk 2077. Lego Star Wars, we already mentioned. Nah. Uh, so, yeah, I, Elden Ring, we already mentioned. Yeah, no, the rest we've already mentioned. So, already. okay, so some of the stuff that uh didn't... Wait, hold up. Oh, there's a new Psychonauts 2 trailer. Cool, cool. Nothing for... It was... Wasn't there, like, barely anything for Halo Infinite, I heard? Yeah, just a, an extended teaser. Okay, like, real talk, though. How is the Halo franchise not dead yet? It should be dead. I... Also, so, sorry, one of some of the things that the leak also got wrong, I just realized, is the, uh, the cross, X-Cross, or whatever it's called, where you could play on your phone <laughs> or your PC mm -hmm. with any game, so that didn't show up. So I guess they're still working on that. And also Fable 4 didn't show up. F. Alright, uh, Bethesda, letting me down. Uh, Elder Scrolls Blades. You gotta throw the whole Bethesda away. <laughs> Fallout 6 Battle Royale. You gotta throw the whole Bethesda away. Um, but no, you know what, I have really, I know they already said that they wouldn't talk about Elder Scrolls 6, but a lot of people didn't believe them. <laughs> 
We're like, you can't not mention Elder Scrolls Six. Guess what we didn't. Yeah, so I was upset because the only reason I care about Bethesda in the slightest is the Elder Scrolls series. Ooh. I was never into Fallout. Still do love Fallout 4. Still can't bring myself to get past the first five minutes of Fallout uh, New Vegas. Which is apparently the best one, which I will one day put to the test, I swear. One day. And they're probably right. Um... Okay, so a, a bunch of a, so there was the PC gaming show, PC Master Race, which had things like Midnight Ghost Hunt, Remnant from the Ashes, Baldur's Gate Three, Shenmue Three, and Borderlands Three. Okay, but why has Avengers A Day not been mentioned yet? Oh, okay, I think it might be here. Is it? Square Enix at E3 2019. Oh, yeah. thing up. Okay, so... Maneater? A shark PG? I don't get what that means. I don't know either. All I know is depth. Um... <laughs> when my depth switch port... You know, sorry, can I say I'm really annoyed with all of these... Like, with the Epic Games launcher. I'm sure you've heard... Isn't that just Steam, but worse? No, but the, the, like some games are going to be exclusive to it for like X amount of time. So it's like, if you want to release on Origin or the Epic Games Launcher, you have to not release it on Steam for X amount of time. And motherfucker, do you want your game to crash? Yeah, no, I, I feel like Steam is if the you, PC gaming thing, so like, it's release not, your games on Steam. It's not that there shouldn't be um, like other online platforms to host your games but to be honest if you don't put your game on steam you're you're kind of joe rogan like i get it you just I get it if you don't no but like it makes me so mad though tris like if you're making a game exclusive to the epic games launcher i'll probably boycott the epic games launcher like, why would you be like, you are not allowed to post your game anywhere else except the Epic Games launcher for, like, from 2019 to 2022 or something? I don't know. You there! Do you like playing PC games? Does it bring you joy? Do you like buying new releases? Fuck you. All right, look. Get this whole new program to buy your games. Because I think... why, why would you go with the tried and true has been working for upwards of 10 years now, right? Probably. Like... God held in the hands of God himself. I think Gabe they... Newell's own love child with God. Steam. No. Get, get I feel that like Epic Steam, like, va like Gabe N, should just use his fat stacks and his, and his assumable neck fat to just buy the Epic Games launcher and Origin. I feel like he could do that, though. I don't think that's outside of the realm of possibility. <laughs> Valve needs to buy EA. No, he's just got to put them on Steam sale. <laughs> And then buy them at a discounted price. Okay, like, for real, though, I just, I really disagree. I don't even think there should be Steam exclusives. I just don't like it when games are, I don't like, as I mean, maybe it's just because I'm a, a I, I don't make a lot of money, but I just don't like exclusive things. Like, Please, I'm, leave my Dota alone. <laughs> like, I feel like you should be able to, like, even with battle passes, as I've mentioned before, I just, I'm not a fan of exclusive things. If it's like, you can only get this here and never anywhere else, or in cases of battle pass, you can get it at X time if you spend money and never again for the rest of your life, I think that's ridiculous. I actually kind of like the idea of exclusive stuff, because I'm going to be real with you. You slap a rarity on just about anything, and there's a good chance I'm going to buy it. I know, it's a marketing technique. I, like, I just, I'm personally but... a really big fan of it. For me, if you're making, say, an item in a game, and it's like, you can only get it for this five minutes, and you will never be able to ever get this item in the history of ever Thanks, past Dota. that point, I hate that, and I think that's ridiculous and stupid. Because why would you spend the time modeling things, animating things, texturing them, making sure they fit in the game, only to be like, yeah, if you didn't play the Battle Pass, I know we spent all this effort, but you'll never get to use it. That Those five people that did that... Like, how many people do you think have that Arcana for, IO, Arcana? for IO? Oh, fucking everyone. 
Yeah, it's it's not hard to do that. It's not like getting tier one hundred and four. Isn't it over now though? Yeah, no, it's over. But like, so like basically no... everyone that played at that point, and they haven't then... been introducing as many new players. Like everyone and their mother got that skin except for me because I didn't want to buy the battle pass. The entire next generation of Dota players cannot use those skin. An entire generation misses out on said skin. Jokes on you. They also get to miss out on the Earthshaker skin after this battle pass. I just it makes me triggered. And like Epic Games, you can suck a fat one. <laughs> Go out to the swamp, find a snake. Do they even have dicks? Do, how do snakes? Re no, they they have no snakes. Don't have dicks. What am I talking about? <laughs> quote of the year right there but like alright look epic games go sit on a duck oh savagery oof just screw your whole launcher in fact I refuse uh, that's it I'm not playing epic games E3 Square Enix they sorry I just thing. okay there Marvel Avengers okay 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 I, I just just I'm, I'm, this is all I have uh, sorry, I'm kind of slow at typing at this angle. Shid. Ah, uh, that's the. <laughs> oh, are you looking up Lord Farquaad? Yes. He's searching Avengers A Day Black Widow. A Day. <laughs> oh, no, A -day. no, 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 no. No, no, no. Can I say I hate how they reorganize Google uh, Images? Hold on, I can't find her. Uh, there it is. Oh, no, 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 no. I hate this. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Google, why did you mess up your... Is there a way to roll back I don't Google? Think so. Look at the chin! It's Lord Farquaad! It's actually Lord Farquaad! Can I just say... Thor in the background look like a default character from Skyrim <laughs> that you just threw a beard on. Yeah, Iron Man's face doesn't look great <laughs> no. either. No, I'd say Hulk looks okay, but he's blurred, so that might be the only reason. <laughs> you gotta throw the whole Square Enix away. <laughs> but like, alright, Google Images, get your game together, because like, that looks terrible. And let's be real, it's Square Enix, so it's probably going to be an RPG. Because that's what Square Enix makes their existence an RPG off of. of Avengers. I, I don't think they show gameplay, but like, I don't know. Man, it's a very cool. oh um yeah, first bits of story. Bit more, they learned a little of the gameplay. Ah, uh, NBA Two K Nineteen is on sale for four dollars. Still not worth it. That's a full price game. Not bad. Um, they did not talk about Life is Strange Two. I don't care. And I love Life is Strange. I still don't care. Sony skipped like a bitch. Um, okay, so let's see Ubi Hard. Oh, Watch Dogs way. Legion. That's a thing. Okami's $18 right now. Dude, not bad. Yeah. Okami for 18 yeah. Alright, we're gonna have to read off that list of games after. That's okay, you got great stuff on here. But... Wait, what? Hmm. What's up? There's a new Just Dance game game for the wii yep the wii yes they still make just dance for the wii we the wii i know they're smoking weed that's legal in canada so you can't demonetize us <laughs> you can just age restrict us <laughs> jokes on you this isn't monetized you know what the, th the whole thing is though is have what you, have you been through our list because i tried looking at our videos on school wi-fi only like the thai videos show up and it confused me at first, but then, what? I, then I looked at our uploads list. Almost every video is age restricted. Really? What? Yeah. No. Yeah. I don't know. They, I, we can't view them on school Wi-Fi. No, that's not correct. No, I'm serious. That that is not correct. It would tell me as the person who runs the channel. I'm telling you, dude. I we couldn't access any of them. It was all blocked. No way. There's I'll take a screenshot of, uh, tomorrow. I'll take a screenshot. Absolutely for you. no way. Maybe I have something in my settings wrong then. But like, cause it's saying? supposed to like, I would saying? know if my videos are age restricted and none of them are age restricted. I'm just saying I can't see. I can only see three of them at school. I think your Wi-Fi just sucks. Is actually it? School no, no, Wi-Fi. They're full on blocked. It says they're blocked. No way. 
I'll get a screenshot of it. That's okay. no Back way. Back on E3. Back on E3. Yo, I'm going to call the school board, like, <laughs> genuinely. Like, Ooh. unironically, like, tomorrow I'm going to call the school board and be like, my videos are blocked in your district. Can you please unblock them? I make gameplay videos. <laughs> Filled with curse words. <laughs> no. Well, I'm the one that curses in them all. <laughs> Dude, all right, look, Realm Royale. Yeah. Dude. Okay, continue, continue. Dude! E3! No, dude! Dude, he shot someone in Realm Royale! Better block this! E3! But wait, I'm I'm literally murdering dudes with a boomerang <laughs> in time. Hey, I boomer? wasn't done yet. Oh, I didn't okay. even read Ubisoft. No, it's because no one cares. Ubisoft Legion, Splinter... Oh, what? Okay, whatever. Splinter Cell. Okay, we're done. Banjo! Oh. Happy! You can read this. Okay, they pulled the thing. Also, I really like the way they opened the trailer. They opened the trailer the exact same way they opened up King K. Rule's trailer. It was basically the King K. Rule trailer a second time. I don't know what that is. No, no, okay. So, it's Donkey Kong. It's a zoom in on his face, and he just yawns. And he's scratching his ass, watching a TV. Diddy's just sitting in a tire. And then they hear a noise outside. They go outside and look at the window to see uh, a big crocodile silhouette. It's like King K. Rule. Mm -hmm. And then King DDD throws off... Uh, his outfit and just starts laughing i'm going on youtube studio to check if my videos are age restricted right now okay just so you're aware so he just starts laughing really hard and then king k rule just hits him in the face and they're like yeah it's actually king k rule when did you check it's like like today two days ago was the dota video out i don't think er, yeah yeah because i was looking for it could you find it no uh, it was... I wonder if maybe it's blocked because they don't like you loading hour-long videos on public Wi-Fi because that know. costs money. So it was... Uh, the way they opened this one is it's the same thing. Donkey Kong yawning and scratching his ass while watching TV. Diddy Kong still in his tire swing. But then King K. Rule's also snoring on the floor. <laughs> and then it's the same thing. And the it's Duck Hunt. Stands up like he looks like Banjo. And then starts... He does the Duck Hunt laugh. And starts popping up everywhere, laughing at them, and then Duck Hunt just sorry, and then Banjo yeah, it says just punches it's not him. age restricted. Yeah, no, Duck Hunt just ends his whole career. Or not Duck Hunt, Banjo ends his whole career, and I'm happy with this. And still, don't care about the hero. I just, I just don't. I'll put it very simply. I just thought it was gonna be a Fire Emblem character, because Three Houses is gonna be a thing, you know. E3, what is next? Okay, it must be something with your school, personally. Don't know, I just work it's here. It's not, I don't think it's actually age-restricted on YouTube, because they would send me an email, at least, or something, I'd assume. What are you looking at? I don't know. Devolver? Oh, Devolver, okay. Don't see any of, anything of interest. Um... Hi, Romo. You're one warm boy. It's very warm in this room. They're selling bootleg versions of their own games at 1% off? No. Nice. Hotline Milwaukee and Catsylvania. Ooh. I just cringed. Ooh. Ooh, damn E3 graphics cards. Ooh. AMD. Romo, why are you laying on me? AMD Navi. I love key game time. Fine. Um, Google at E3. <laughs> um, Google Stadia. Oh, don't know what that is. Um. Okay, it's a streaming service coming out from Google. It'll be ten, 10 bucks a month. Unlimited game streaming. Oh, you can stream games? Or... Oh, that's neat, I think. Uh, if that's what that actually is? I'm pretty sure you can stream certain games on Netflix. What? Yeah. I know Minecraft Story Mode was available for I'm a while. I'm gonna kill myself. That's that's not a meme, either. Dang it, now we're gonna get restricted in your school. <laughs> because of minecraft Story i'm mode. so mad about that like genuinely okay, okay. like i am please move on i'm actually pissed about that i'm gonna call your school or not no your school board and i'll be like i used to go to your school <laughs> i won't mention you at all though 
Okay, so Google Stadia, that's about it. Okay, that's that's it for the recap of there. Now we do have another game list trailer thing. Do you want to go through the... Do you want to... Yeah, go through that first. All right, he's going to tell you the deals for Switch right now. Let's go. Uh, Mario Odyssey. I don't know what it's on sale for. I own it. Uh, Final Fantasy VII. That's like 17 CAD Canadian dollars. Cuphead. Remember that? That was a thing. I have that. Mario Tennis Aces. Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. Dragon Ball Fighters. Spelt with a Z. Travis Strikes Again. No more heroes. Uh, for ya boys out there who bought the Switch thinking it was just a handheld Wii, uh, Just Dance is on here. Fire Emblem Warriors. Final Fantasy X slash Ten Two HD Remaster. Rocket League. That's the thing I haven't heard in a while. Hyrule Warriors. SNK Hero Hero Wines. Tag Team Friends. That looks like a hentai fighting game. Uh, Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. Doom. Mega Man 11. Shantae the Half-Genie Hero. FIFA 19. Elder Scrolls 5. Skyrim. Okami HD. Final Fantasy 9. Overcooked 2. Tales of Vesperia Definitive Edition. Darksiders War Mastered Edition. The Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Trilogy. Not bad. Mortal Kombat 11. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Diablo 3 Eternal Collection, Sid Meier Civ 6, uh, Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze, Wolfenstein 2 The New Colossus, Kirby Star Allies, it's good I swear, uh, Unravel 2, Celeste, Xenoblade Chronicles 2, Crypt of the Necro Dancer, NBA 2K Playgrounds 2, Undertale, Dank Souls Remastered, Starlink Battle for Atlas Deluxe Edition, I'm pretty sure Fox McCloud's in that game and that's the only reason anybody's gonna buy it. Stardew Valley, The Messenger, Dead Cells, di- dis- g- Game, Monster <laughs> Boy and the Cursed Kingdom, Katamari D- Damacy Reroll. K- Dude, K- Katamari, I, I oh don't God. mind those games. Wargroove, Hollow Knight, Mario and Rabbit's Gold Edition, and NBA 2K19. Yeah. All the videos are here. Bop. I bop the boy. The Womo. The Romo. It's your boy Romulus. Okay, it's definitely your school. They're not age restricted. I just logged out to see. Okay. Does that mean there's some dude sitting in some office watching all of our videos to determine if they can go to your school? I don't know. Or maybe it's it's probably an algorithm your school. I'll stop focusing on it because I feel like you're getting annoyed with me. Um, alien isolation for the Switch. Cool, I guess. Rad. Rad. The, also, all these are clickable trailers. When my next Conquer's Bad Fur Day. Never. <laughs> I'm sorry, but never. Okay, okay, I got a real quick thing. So, Oh, there's Astral Chain. Let me try and uh, find a knife cool. here. Is there a knife in here? Yes, there indeed is. Okay. Okay, so, you see this knife? So, <laughs> you know, my dog is doing his thing, right? And all of a sudden, he puts the knife in his mouth. He's, you know, he's holding it like this. And I look at him and go, I just thought of a great idea for a legendary Pokemon. Is it's it just a genius. dog with a knife? Yeah, it's just... <laughs> it's a like, Pokemon? No, no, it's face. The legendary Pokemon for sword. Oh. Its face is like a sword. <laughs> Except what? it's a dog, but the sword goes out horizontally, not vertically. It goes out this way. Then they that's, were like, that's okay, weird. okay, damn. We need to get a shield for him. Oh, no. Uh, okay. And they were thinking, we use this. Oh, look at the dog. And then he got his head stuck in a book and they were like yo yo i just thought of it what if we just made his head a big shield but it's the same thing there you go that's the pokemon for sword and shield they look stupid also the new grass starter is just you took the one book that probably will never be able to sit back where it was get destroyed uh and then the new grass starter is just Chimchar, but yep. grass. I saw that one. It it's was stupid. Um, 
I don't care about anything else coming out. I'm gonna be real with you. There's a lot of pages of these. Sea of Thieves Anniversary Edition, guys. I wonder if they put the game in that game, too. Yo, I've been playing this, like, weird side-scroller game lately called Jump Jet Rex. Yeah, I know what it is. It's actually pretty good. The Vangers. <laughs> good. Lord of Farquaad. <laughs> <laughs> Like, it's not just me. She looks like Lord Farquaad. <laughs> Ramen. There's a game called Ramen. You know, I guess it's pretty much all the neat things that happened in E3. That's all the E3 oh, content. I'm pretty sure they announced something about the PS5. Oh, probably. But, like, here's the thing is, um, I don't hair i feel like the ps4 is capable already like it's already what would you make that's better you know what would be cool hear me out hear me Re release out. the ps2 and make ps2 games again okay okay so you all of the epic gamers want ekbok and sony to come together to make good so why don't you just take the xbox and the playstation and you just and you call it like the the PSX, because I mean it's still yeah. a number technically for PlayStation, and it's got the X for Xbox. Why don't you make like the PSX, which is a combination of both consoles? You know, why don't we just all get Soldier Games and make the Soldier Game the console of the future? No, thank you. Okay, no, I got a great idea. PC Master Race. Next question. We have like 15 minutes left. It's okay, I got you. I can fill 15 minutes, and you know I can. Are you going to talk Future Fight or Magic? I was going to say, you know it's not a podcast if I don't complain about Future Fight. You know, sorry, I have a theory. Let me get my phone. No, no, wait. I have a theory as to why the Dungeons & Dragons podcast didn't do too well. Did I not talk about Future Fight enough? No, we talked about Future Fight so much that I listed it under the category of Future Fight. Uh, like... Oh no. It got five views. It was good. <sighs> got my phone turn on here because it, it died. When my when my future fight switch port. Oh wait, that's coming. It's called MUA3. Dude. I might upload some, some Jump Jet Rex videos. Okay. I was actually considering, but I might not. I was considering live commentary Wednesdays. Where, like, I would just play a random game with actual live commentary. And that'd be every Wednesday that'd come out. I should just start filming more Dota. You really should, because but that video did quite well. I'm lazy. Depends on if the boys want Dota. And, like, so Tai 2 just came out yesterday. Um, yeah. We're recording this on Thursday, by the way. But... So Tai 2, the video came out, it was good, but I've been having so many issues recording that game that I don't know if I'm going to do a part 3 unless people really want it. Because that's twice in a row it got to our third best video, and it's only been out a day. So like, I might do a third part, but the issue is, I had to re-record that first episode five separate times. Why? Because... It lagged in game, but not on camera. Ah. Which I don't know how that's physically possible for it to record at a higher frame rate than I'm playing it. But so I didn't even bother because I was like, "This is too laggy. I'll just delete this." And then I and then I did it with less graphics, and it was good, but it derped out and like deleted the recording or like got corrupted or whatever. So like a series of issues like that happened. But after, on the fifth try, I finally got an episode that I could put out. And then, with the second episode, it, uh... I think the second episode was okay, actually, because I recorded that the same day. But then the issue was that I missed a lot of stuff. So I made a video going back and getting it all, but that video also corrupted. So I restarted the entire game on a new save file and recorded myself getting the stuff that I missed. 
But you see, the best part about that is that for some reason that recorded the, only the audio and not the video. And I also did the third level in that. And then, so I don't want to restart the save file for a third time. But like, the videos are doing really well. So if people want it, I'll do it. And also live commentary Wednesdays, yes or no, please comment. Talk about Future Fight. I almost have Deadpool at tier 3. Is that Max tier? Yeah, that's like a momentous occasion since he's like the best character in the game. Um, yeah, there's been no new patches. They put on some sales, I guess, which is neat. The sales are good. The challenges they put out are good. There's... The only problem is Jean Grey's fucking broken still. Like, it's it's through the roof currently. The meta of PvP is Jean Grey. The meta of PvE is Deadpool. Or Jean Grey. Like, why? Why? Also, she costs as much as Thanos does. How much does Thanos cost? Way too much. Like, uh, your uniforms are normally uh, crystals. I think it's... I don't know how much a normal uniform goes for. I, I don't buy uniforms at normal price. Okay, um... Your, like, your low-tier uniforms are, on average, 1,250 crystals. Okay. Your high-tier uniforms, like Infinity War, Endgame, that kind of thing. Let me just try and track one down here. Um, we'll go with Psylocke's new uniform. It is 1,750. So when they go on sale... The twenty, the twelve hundred uniforms are on for seven fifty, and the seventeen hundreds are on for one thousand fifty. Thanos and Jean Grey's uniforms cost normally two thousand five hundred, and are on sale for fifteen hundred, which is basically just the price of a normal uniform. But at the same time, Thanos and Jean Grey are some of the best characters in the game, so that's a thing. Is it worth it then? Yeah, technically. I'm just upset that of all the mutants that could have gotten stuff, it's Scott's Eye Candy. That's the best mutant in the game, Scott's yeah, Eye Candy. Yeah, you're more of an X-Men fan than I am, but I always, even I thought she was kind of boring. Like, I had some interest in her after the whole Phoenix thing, but even then, she's not that cool, I thought. We need to see Dark, Dark Phoenix. Phoenix. No, apparently we don't, because apparently it sucked. Wow, just like... Th- the one that it's a remake of yeah we gotta see it anyway i probably will eventually i want to you know i'm gonna see no i'm gonna check that later actually i was gonna be like yo we should go see it together but then i don't if some place like the roxy's playing it that'd be cool i'd go see it there i wouldn't go to calgary for it though Nice, dude. I don't know. It's it's the thing. That's about all it is to me. It's a movie. <sighs> yup. I was really excited for it, to be honest. Um. What's okay? What else can we talk about? I uh, I listened to the album Crash Talk. By Schoolboy Q. It's that song I showed you the other mm-hmm. day with the weird guitar. Yeah. Uh, that album. Not bad. Not bad. Definitely not. I mean, I, you know what? For for what it is, it's pretty good. There's a couple songs I think are like the summer th- songs. Like, you know, a song of the summer type thing. Mm-hmm. But overall, it's nothing I haven't heard before. The only one that I really love from that album is Dangerous, the song I showed you. That guitar is, like, addicting. So we we did some cool stuff, as I'm sure you were aware. Uh, we bought a full of the new Magic set, Modern Horizons. We're talking, because we bought locally, the booster box ran us about $325. This is Canadian for anyone who isn't from here. So, you know, that's, that's a lot of money, put simply. But uh, we pulled... I think it's... So, uh, sorry, that's about 245 American. 
So like, like I said, it, it's it's a good amount of money. We we didn't pull anything we wanted, but we pulled good. I don't know. The cards in this set are disgustingly overwhelming because it's like everything is good. There is not a single card in this set I can say. I mean, that card's just okay. They're just all really good. Especially the, bad thing. the new Planeswalkers they release. It's Sarah the Benevolent. I think she might be a reprint. I don't think so. And uh, Renin 6. I thought you were going to say Renin Stimpy. No, I was confused. Renin 6. No. Renin 6 are really good. They give spells in your graveyard. Un- or, sorry. Instance and sorcery an ability called Retrace. Where you can cast them again if you discard a land. And his first ability is bring a land card back from the graveyard and put it into your hand. So you can spam this, and it's pretty good, but, like, uh, I don't know. He didn't fit well in anything I played, but after opening the booster box, there's a lot of cards that combo with him really, really well. Wait, with... Ren and Six. And I'm not surprised he's so expensive. And I feel like we should a bunch do of... magic as a video at one point. Like, you should. There's a bunch of crappy pain lands. Pain lands are... You... They are two colors. You can tap it for either color of mana, but you take a damage when you do so. And they have a second ability where you can pay one mana and then sacrifice it to draw a card. These are like $20 for some reason. That's weird. Upwards of $20. We're talking, I saw the cheapest one for like $35 at our local place. Also, um, sorry, this is unrelated. We have three Paladins videos coming out where we duoed. What do you think of my meme thumbnails? Because only the memes get clicks. There's... <laughs> I... I... Uh... I... Uh, I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like this. But will it get clicks because it's memes? <laughs> yeah. I don't think that one will, but that one and that one will. You don't like Barack Obama? I do not like Barack Obama. That's the one that I'm set on. Really, the Woody one is the one I was like, I don't know about that. I don't know, man. But wall. <laughs> Maybe I'll just get you to pick the memes for the thumbnails. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, shoot, what do we got coming out? Um, so, for me, at least... Um, some new videos coming out. There is gonna be another Similand video, except I just kind of memed because my people kept building churches. But if they build churches, it also caps their IQ, so they can't get smarter. So, <laughs> so I, I just I meteor struck the churches so that oh they wouldn't God. have a church. But then they built a That'd second a one. Legend. They built one after because I'm too nice and kept giving them what I what they wanted. So I meteor struck their, them a second time. And it was pretty good, but it's not my best video for, like, at least my, it's not my best gameplay. I'm gonna have to do one where I get, like, IQ 200. You gotta throw the whole church away. <laughs> but you you kind of do, though, because, like, I really don't appreciate that mechanic in the game. But it... <laughs> I think it's funny, personally. It's funny, yeah. And then... It's, it's savage. There's a... I did three matches of Paladins in one video. That's coming out. We have a... I'll, I'll Dota eventually. I have... I think I have two wins in Realm Royale that are going to be uploaded. I actually, as a hint... Uh, sorry, as a, as a thing, I don't think anyone cares. But I kind of wanted to um, to do Twitch. I was thinking about maybe starting up a Twitch. Might upload highlights or something. If you do Twitch, I'm... Yeah, you can upload the highlights, dude. I'll, we can link your Twitch and stuff. I don't know, it was just a thought. I'm not totally sold on doing it. Because when I was in high school, I did Twitch. Now that's edgy. <laughs> I used to do Taboy on Twitch. Oh, boy. Yeah, dude. Because, like, that's back when uh, the Martin Fi lived in our basement. And then he was like, yo, if you want to get big, you got to stream Taboy on Twitch. <laughs> and it's so not wrong. So that's what I did back in the day. So, like, if you want to put highlights on, you're more than welcome to. But other than that, there's just our three Paladins Duos videos. So you got stuff to look forward to, along with probably Jump Jet Rex, even though I suck at the game really terribly. Why don't you just get better at the game, lol? And what do you have 
Just what do I have? Probably Dota. Uh, I don't know. We're, we'll probably end up doing something with magic. The only problem is if we do a magic thing, the last I'd want to do two headed giants, and we do them in sets of three, so it's first to two wins. How long would that be as a video? Would we have to? One turn took me over half an hour once. That was the most wombo combo turn. The eight thousand two hundred and six damage turn <laughs> to forty HP less than that turn. I think it may have took taken me forty five minutes to set up. Okay, well, look. So I'm, can, I'm just saying. It can happen. You got, you can make a video on it. It would be like it would be a long and then, video. Are you still doing Smash? Uh, I'm just saying that it's kind of all scrapped. So like maybe eventually I'll probably end up putting it together again. You and me will do a Smash video, and I'll beat you as Falco. Yeah, in the, in the Smash game that doesn't have Falco in it. Yeah. Yup. Oh, I guess I can't play it with you then. Exactly. Sorry, for reference, I only play Falco. Like, it's literally the only Smash game with no Falco. I guess that's about it. That's all we're... Oh, hey, we're actually an hour and one minute here. Hey, guess what? We hit the time frame. You know what I hate? I hate it when YouTubers stretch to get that ten minutes for that ad revenue. I know, like we, were... we just did. It's so annoying. Gotta hit that ten minute mark. All right, look, we have to hit that 10-hour mark. Let's keep going. Hi, Romo. Do you want to breathe into the mic for, like, <laughs> nine hours? Dog breathes into mic for nine hours after podcast. Yo, sorry, I'm also considering if I can actually do this, this will be the last time the podcast is recorded in this format. Oh. I want to set something up so that I have to edit way less because we'll put pictures on the screen live. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, dude. Cool. We'll put, we'll put pic- like, we'll have a thing. And that way, if we could set it up properly, hell, we could probably even live stream this. I don't edit this shit. Doesn't matter to me. Because this takes, like, two hours of editing, at least. Because I'm, I just listen to everything we say, and if there's something worth putting on the screen, I Google the image, save it, put it into the video... And then it's like... Don't real... forget about Lord Farquaad. You have to put that picture uh, in. Trust me, I am. But, like, what if... No, 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 I'm just no, saying. I didn't have to edit. So, if I can figure out a program, like, that's just, like, a blank screen that I can just add images to, that's probably what we're gonna end up doing. Fair enough. And then we could live stream it, but I don't think anyone would watch. Oof. But then when it comes out as a video, you know... I don't know, I kind of like doing it as a video, though. Anyway, we we should do the outro here. Man, you know, there would be an outro here. It's just that I can't wait to milk next year's E3. Just you wait. Next next week, cringe comp. <laughs> Are we just PewDiePie now? Okay, look, no, the cringe comp One is my favorite part. million troops. Two. Wow. But, like, seriously, my favorite part of E3 is the cringe comps. You so bet. A giant I'm... enemy crab. Dude. Yeah, I don't know. So, you know what? This was uh, the second part. If you haven't seen the first part, go back and watch the E3 leaks. I also meant to do this just because I really, like, it's annoying me. Can, can like, one person watch my Hero Shooter ASMR? Because it's at nine views, and it's, like... The one that's... No balls, you won't. Okay, good. (laughs) There we go. Because, like, all of the videos before that, every last one has above 10, and then that one has 9, and then Similand has, like, 12. And I just wanted to have 10 views. Can one person watch it? It's it's not good. (laughs) But watch it anyway. Anyway, sorry, you can continue your outro. (laughs) Uh, That's E3. (laughs) That's just how this is going to end. Goodbye.